We can just catch the last, it's the uh, 8th of August, um, 2018. So we'll just catch the last little glimpse of the St. John's wort. This is it, it's pretty little flowers, which are bloom mainly at midsummer. And um, these make a very nice tea for help to promote good quality sleep. Um, very commonly used in Eastern European countries um, as a nighttime drink for the whole family. You need to be aware not to use this if you're taking certain medications, so you should check that with your pharmacist or your herbalist. And this is the St. John's wort as it runs to seed. And you can see the red. Um, and if it's the right St. John's wort, this red, if you put the flowers into oil and leave it on a sunny windowsill for several weeks, the oil will turn red. And that will tell you that it's the medicinal um, hypericum, the hypericum perforatum or St. John's wort. And just while we're here, we can also see the flowers of the evening primrose. And it's the seeds from this, um, which are just developing underneath. It's the seeds from this that are squeezed. It's a very tiny seed, I don't know how they do it, but that's what's squeezed for your, for your evening primrose oil. Great. So that's lovely.